funny. I appreciate it. Thank you. Okay, let me put my face cam back and everything to where it goes. Real quick. We're up to episode eight. I think there's 12 episodes, so we'll probably finish it tomorrow. And watch like a couple, maybe two or three right now, and then watch two or three tomorrow. Oops. Okay, there. Uh, okay, we're up to eight. Season seven, episode eight. Who went home last time, Brooke? I think that was so loud. I think Brooke got eliminated last time we watched. But uh, okay, I liked Brooke, but honestly, looking back at her photos, they really weren't that good. Like, Brooke was robbed. I liked her, but I didn't, her photos weren't that good. Yeah, Brooke got eliminated, and it was her graduation night. She was crying, and she was like, On my graduation night, are you serious? And Tyra was like, You should be lucky to even be here. There's tons of girls who would rather be here than at your graduation. There's not that many left. Hey guys, we got a letter from Brooke. Tell me how the volume huge surprise, is. Brooke going home. Regina, no one expected it. Everyone was so sad. We love you, Brooke, and we gonna miss you like hell. You brought to this house a feeling I could feel. I saw an improvement in her bigger than anyone else. And it just sucks because, you know, so many people don't appreciate it. She really didn't do that good. Like I like this season. Doing this and be happy with it. With me, it's the exact opposite of everybody. This was never my dream. I have the talent to be a model. I just don't know if I have. I have everything that it takes, like, you know, the, the fashion knowledge, which I know I don't and have. And Michelle came out as lesbian. I'm, I'm, I'm not having, I'm not figuring it out. Michelle came this. out as lesbian. I want to win this. I want to do big things with my life. And I'm seeing people stay week after week who don't even want it. One girl out of the competition, who would it be? Love time. Why y'all looking at me that way? <laughs> I feel like Jada's gonna go. Hey, is that her name? I already kind of forgot. I feel like Jada's gonna go home. Hi. I'm Gabby Reese, and I'm here to talk to you about action modeling. I was actually really, really excited to see Gabrielle Reese. Oh, they're gonna I call Angel back. She's be athletic and model, and then she's a perfect example of doing both. I used to model, and then I played professional beach volleyball after that, and I always was doing modeling that Hi, had a lot of action fun. in it. I played volleyball in college, and so seeing Gabrielle, I was just so excited. It kind of gave me a better attitude about this whole competition. First off, she was never a cheerleader. Die for volleyball on a mark. She Make played it look volleyball. Real, but then somehow what a queen. remembering to still look good to camera. And now you guys are going to go over there and change into your bikinis, and we'll get started and have a lot of fun. Thousand ladies, way to slide. Thousand ladies, way to slide. And they say she's fat. I'm not a very sporty person. My body isn't in this shape right now. I don't need to be in a bikini doing action moves. Who's your favorite? So Probably really her. I love girls. I don't want to be here. I actually doesn't like to be in a bikini because she's got a little bit of extra her weight on her that as a model, I don't think she can have. Now, here's the deal. Think about it. There's a camera right here that you're trying to get underneath the ball, make it look real. And all you're going to have to do is watch. And all you have to do is dive up and get it right. OK, Carrie D, go first. I'm here today to teach action modeling because it's hard to catch an action shot. Sometimes. I kind of like really Carrie D, honestly. To bring those emotions up to the eyes. So it doesn't matter I like if Carrie D. Or couture or anything. Okay, here we go. Oh my goodness. You don't want to have some facial expression that's so gritty that they wouldn't really use it. I feel like that was really goofy and awkward. Hopefully, if there was a photographer there, they would have got a good shot. Here we go. Good try. That's good. That's okay. Okay, next one. I played volleyball like in 10th grade and I sat on the bench. I also like her a lot too. It sucks. Here we go. Go, go. Good try. Jada, do it up. Oh, Jada. It was really nice to actually Jada's do something got I know this. how to do. Go ahead. And it had to relate to modeling. Excellent. Let's give her a hand. Okay, she's kind of babe. Okay, she's kind of babe. Amanda, look excited. Just react to it. Volleyball kind of sucks. Oh. I look stupid. I want to also be able to see your face. Okay, who's next? Jada kind of ate. Okay, Michelle's going to go. I actually am nervous, basically because I look like I'm about to break a lot She's of time. lesbian. She's going to eat. Here we go. <laughs> no, okay? she did not eat. See, it doesn't matter because if the camera guy's right here, he could look the same as if the ball went perfect. Okay, next one. Acho, okay, if we were shooting, we'd have to be totally in our gear. Acho didn't even want to come out in her bathing suit. She seems a little bit shy. Acho, you're a model. You have to be ready to be stripped down at any time when you're a model. Here we go. Melrose is so jealous of her. Okay, good. <laughs> Look a little more intense. Okay. Here you go. Go get it. Go get it. Good 
Good try. She so ain't. It's just a question of her getting comfortable knowing that she can do it. So we worked on some of the important things for action modeling, and I really appreciate you spending the day with me, and, and I want to wish you all good luck. Thank you. OK, bye, you guys. Bye. Bye. This album as an album. Acho is always self-conscious. It makes her look even, I guess, more flabby and more like a big old blob the way she carries herself, because she doesn't carry herself like she's proud of what she has. I hate this storyline. There's two sides to Achal, and one is sexy and confident, and one is, like, timid and shy. She just doesn't have the confidence at all. This isn't about just having a really gorgeous face. Yeah. I just don't get it. I'm so frustrated. I'm frustrated with her attitude. I'm frustrated with her pictures. Mind your fucking like, business. I just wish you would go home already, because I've seen a lot of photos of you where it's like... Being in the house, I do feel like I have no friends. I'm not nice Melrose to her models because I've tried being nice to her. Trying to get along with her doesn't work. She does bitchy little things, and it makes you want to slap the hoe. Real up. Uh, Are her. you going to snap? Yeah, on your the side. Is on. Love, tired. Love, tired. Slap yeah. her. Do it. She fucking deserves it. We're in the middle of nowhere. Don't really have any idea what we could be doing. It's so freaking hot. And then there's like this racetrack. <laughs> Well, we walk down this racetrack and we see this baby guy. Oh my god. That's a guy? He looks like a gothic drag queen. I'm James St. James, author, bon vivant, and NASCAR enthusiast. James St. James is a very bubbly character. I've seen him on past seasons and he's just really out there. I'm here to judge the girls. Yesterday, they learned um, some action photography. Who today, the I'm fuck here is to help this? incorporate that into uh, the challenge today. I'm here with Stanton Barrett, the hump muffin of racing. I'm Stanton Barrett, NASCAR driver and team owner. I've also been involved in fashion, recently shooting with Walter Chin and Loma Vogue. I saw that. That was fantastic. So we're here today to shoot action shots. You guys learned about that yesterday, and we're going to incorporate it in your shooting today. Now, a lot of times, what happens is you'll be arguing with your boyfriend over whose career is more important. Stanton Barrett is going to be your boyfriend. And you're going to be angry with them. You're going to be leaping and jumping. During this, you're going to shoot your own shots today with this remote control. I want you to click on the button and face the camera as you do. You have 10 minutes to get dressed. Now go! Go, bitches. The challenge is to incorporate action into the photography. Okay, process. Jada's going to eat this. Go ahead, I already know it. Yeah. Does he have a career that's more important than yours? No, okay, then Mark gets it. Go! Oh, that was good. Okay, eight. Yeah, it's really difficult because you have to air while you're trying to look mad at She's things. eating. She's yes. eating, though. Yes! Santa was just a punching bag. My She's career eating. Is more than yours. Oh, no! Go! Attack! She looks stupid. Oh, yeah. Go! Yeah! Oh, Jada's oh, eating. Go. I knew it. Yeah! Jada's eating. I knew oh, it. Go! Yes! Not even. And can't go. even see your face. That was good. Very good. Okay. Oh, that, that one was good. This is your last race, bitch. Uh -oh. Final lap. Attack. Oh. Your last lap. That was really hot. Ah! I love you. We'll Does she know she still has to be pretty? <laughs> okay. okay, our next girl. Okay, Achel. mother. Okay. Let's bring out your boyfriend. I feel like too pretty. Fish. Use oh your passion, God. use your anger. They all make drama, fun of her because okay? she's too pretty. And like, go, they're so action. jealous. When it gets to my turn, I'm so nervous that I'm like, oh man, I don't want to do this. Just a minute. I'm afraid, like, I'm gonna kill him don't be afraid of him. He's tougher than I he can. looks. Look at the camera, get mad at him, attack him now. I'm so afraid of my boobs falling out. That's the problem. I don't care about your boobs. Let's go. Oh How many times have we seen Photoshop? Come on. Go, now, jump, leap. <laughs> How many shots is that? Person. You have to be angry. It's your career. How bad do you want this? Acho doesn't even show that she's trying, and it's frustrating. Next girl is Michelle. Come on out. She's Here we go with the last one. Finding us do something with just pictures, the thing I'm good at. The bullying gods are her. Action, so the bullying gods are her. Oh, she ain't. Oh, she ain't. Did her heel just go into his school? Okay, but she ate. Now, as you know, that was a very difficult shoot, I think, but you all did a really fantastic job. She Definitely ate. a tough choice. But our she's our winner win. was. Who was our winner? It was Michelle, right? Come on, go. Come over here, girl. Give us a hug. Lesbian girl A. <laughs> Michelle wins the challenge today, and it's really exciting because Michelle's never won, so I'm glad I went to someone that wasn't Eugenia or Melrose. Then you get to pick three friends to participate in what you get for your award. Uh, Carrie D. Hey! There you go, there's one. <laughs> Uh, uh, no, was... Yay! Yay! Okay. I'm surprised just because 
Pick all, all white girls. girls. Like, nobody likes her as a friend. We just kind of know we have to deal with her. Pick all, all white girls. One is, you have won the opportunity Thank you, Cook. Thank you, I'm 23 today. Shopping spree. Ah! What? <laughs> Of course, I'm sad that I can't get to share in the reward. I'm the only girl who hasn't been chosen for any other things. Oh, hey! Hi! Welcome, girls. Hi. Hi. You're here in our fashion showroom. We produce all sorts of events, none bigger than our billion dollar babe sample sale. We've got uh, over $10,000 worth of handbags. She doesn't even like Melrose. She literally thinks Melrose is an so annoying bitch. And she today. still picks her over the other three Michelle, girls. you're the winner, and your three friends you pick Amanda, Melrose, and Terry D. You have 30 seconds from that line. Like, she literally doesn't even like room. Melrose. Put on as many clothes as you can. None you're of not the back girls here, like Melrose. 30 seconds, you're disqualified. If you make it back in 30 seconds, the person with the most clothes wins with everybody's clothes. What? Okay, cool. Are you ready? Help us out, all dresses. <laughs> Go. to watch Melrose has a Nick Dom no it's true can we sit in limo can we go home I mean we have to stand here and watch Nine, eight, I would share it with everyone seven, if I was six, You've done exceptionally well. I'm impressed. I'll tell you what. I've seen some sample sale shopping, but this takes the cake. We have to now count your items to identify the winner. We have two handbags, three items, four, five. Girl, six, I don't give a fuck who won this. Well One pair of trousers, two, three, four, three Jessica Elliott necklaces. That would make seven, eight, nine, ten, and one more pair at eleven. Well done. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So far, we have Michelle in the lead with 11. Michelle One, win it, two, lesbian three, queen. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, ah! 11, 12, Lucky number 13. 13. In that order. Oh, thank you so much. What happens now, Stan? Yeah, what happens? Unfortunately, everybody has to give Melrose their clothes. I didn't know there was a challenge within my challenge prize, so I get nothing unless Melrose gives me something, so that kind of sucks. <laughs> It's like a dream. We were in the back laughing because Melrose grabs everything because she understood the rules, but the other girls didn't. Yeah. It feels really good to get the clothes, but I feel like every girl is wanting to kill me right now. I hate Melrose. She's my least favorite. Closer to my sister, and I'm closer to Katie, and then... Meg was, was my least favorite, favorite, but now Melrose is my least favorite. The girls were talking about who you liked in the gone, beginning, who you didn't gone. like in the beginning. I do feel like I have no friends here. You act like you're a child. You don't even know me to say that. Acho, you have no respect for other people's space. You have walked into me ten times in this house and not even thought twice about it. I can't talk to these girls. I just want to get away from it. It's affecting me, which is bad, because I don't want it to affect me. Oh, my God. Time out! Tomorrow, you will defy the biggest model stereotype. Don't be an airhead. They're but literally love bullying her. I know, it's going to be something about models being stupid. OK. Hi, <laughs> ma'am. So we flew up to this airport, and so we're thinking, what's going on? And I'm like, oh my gosh, we're going skydiving. Oh hell no! Hey, oh I'm hell no! I would today, never baby. go skydiving. Like, what have you guys been learning about this week? Action! So we got an expert action photographer here to shoot you girls. Oh, Patrick, hell come no. on out here. Hey. Hi, Patrick. Hey, 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 Patrick. And the real exciting part is today is your very first. Cover Girl assignment. Ah, yay! Cover Girl is adding a new foundation to their True Blend family, and it's called True Blend Whipped Foundation, which is all about being light and weightless, so you almost don't feel it on your skin. We're gonna make you girls sexy space sirens if there is such a thing. Now, we're not gonna go up. For Jada's gonna eat this one. It's a sporty I'm competition. Just because and she's I'm not very too sporty. cool with that. I jump out of a plane. I'm not trying we to get hurt. We all know Jada's But we are putting you in the one. air. Finally. That's a training facility. Why does he sound like this? We're gonna he's do talking is fast. Put you he's over excited. a huge fan that makes you airborne. So let's go. Let's have fun. Let's get airborne. Okay. Indoor skydiving lesson is one of my things that Indoor I've always wanted to do. It's super exciting. What the fuck is indoor skydiving? This looks fucking stupid. 
have a couple of instructors to help you. This is Shane. Flying is really easy. The key to that, to that is staying slow and staying in control. And remember, this is going to be a composite picture. We're going to put you in space with CoverGirl Foundation. Go to hair and makeup. This is actually the foundation that you're going to be shooting with oh, today. Really? Oh, it's true. Raja! Raja! Raja. 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 You ready to do this, Keep on. Raja. Raja. Okay, look good, girl. You better eat. I like you Michelle. You're pretty much holding you the whole time. When, once you reach out there and like mess up your balance, you just flip everywhere. It's so hard to like stay balanced. Michelle's body language is pretty good. The problem is Michelle lacked a lot of grace. Uh, and her hands looked like catcher's mitts. Now, what was the problem with you flipping over? <laughs> Thanks, Michelle. Uh, this is hard. Like, like how are they that supposed to do this? It's, it's hard to control. I'm feeling pretty confident She's about gonna this. She's going to eat. Shoot. You look cute. I do think I have a cover girl face. I have a cover girl attitude. There is, yeah. I stepped into this chamber light thing. The wind is blowing upward, and... You're just, your whole face is like flapping. I really had to focus on keeping my body really relaxed, including my face. Jada, in general, is not the most graceful girl on set. But today, <laughs> this shoot might just save Jada. She just looked super graceful. I you knew she up? was going to no, eat. Like, Ooh, go higher. <laughs> This week has been all about action, action, action modeling. I want one of the twins to go home so the other one cries. Oh, she's eating, bitch. I'm doing kind of not so good at first. I was having a hard time getting used to she it. She ate, really? Really, really? I thought she looked good. Amanda, she was like flailing around like a rag doll. I felt bad. It was crazy, but it was so much fun. Oh, twist. Oh, I love this. The thing I love about Amanda is <laughs> she put her arm up and then she reached her other hand down to her chest. And it looks so graceful, like a, a ballerina. She looks sky. good, though. That was great. And you're the only girl who went and put their hand on her chest. Good job. Angel, this looks really great on you. It's just kind of lightweight. Yeah, it's really light. I can barely feel it. Raja. Suck it in. Oh, yeah, suck. Oh, suck it in harder. Girl, she would be floating. She ain't sucking nothing. Yeah. Suck it in. Raja? I hope I get some pictures. I'm kind of nervous. Oh, you better I eat, Mama. Amanda, though, and I was like, oh, crap. She's eating. When I was flipping around, I saw them looking. I'm like, why are you guys here? Stop. Don't look at me. Angel didn't come off graceful. As if that's anything new. Eugenia, if you want to go from this move to this move, you got to do it like this. This to that. Photo shoot was pretty important because they've been telling me over and over again that I have no face in my picture. So my main focus was to have a nice face through the goggles and the big helmet and all the wind and everything like that. They're all doing the same pose, yeah. No, you always give us an amazing shot. Make the girls hate you even more. Oh, this good. show is so biased I towards her. Well I already know that. she's going to win. Like, I just know she's going to win. Because she's the judge's favorite. Tomorrow's is my day's competition. You know, she tries just as hard as I do. I want to say Melrose was great, but Melrose was pretty flat. Melrose's face read completely blank. I don't know what went wrong. <sighs> it was harder than you thought. Yeah. You lost it. You went, oh my god, I'm turning. Instead of, oh, there's the product. There's oh, the thank product. god there's she the See what I'm saying? I'm not happy. It was almost like I wanted to jump back in there and do it again. Melrose wasn't the best. Ooh, thank god. Oh, thank god. Are you ready? They have beef. This is seriously like the coolest thing I have ever done. It feels really cool to be in a I like Harry D. I was a little apprehensive at first because I get motion sickness really easily. But it wasn't anything like that. You just feel so free She's and light. She's a bit boring. Carrie D was just all over the place, flipping backwards and forwards. She did not listen to me or the instructor. We told all the girls to make all their movements really slow. But to Carrie D's credit, though, when things started going literally belly up, she kept reaching for that cover girl foundation. I was really twisting and turning, giving those guys who were holding me a ride. They were really tired afterwards. Maybe Carrie D will finally win. Judges, only six will continue on the hopes of becoming America's next top model. Love, time. Six. 
I think with elimination that it's going to be a hard panel. We do not want to go to panel tomorrow. I think Angela. The pictures are going to be very beautiful. I feel like I probably got a good photo out of it. But since there wasn't any positive feedback, I'm not going to walk into panel as confident as I have before. I do not want to go. Melrose should go home. She's the most freaking annoying person I've ever met. I'm tired of people leaving. It's making me depressed. I said if there's a jacked up picture that shows up on there, I'm just going to be like, send me home. I want Jada to get the first picture because I'm rooting for. <laughs> In her schmuck. Tyra's reveals are Hello, so Welcome bad. To the again. We had a really Here I am in my video. grandma dress. Hi yeah, guys. A lot of movement and a lot of action. So let's get the action going right now. You know the judges. The first is noted fashion photographer Nigel Barker. I guess. Like she never Diva, eats. Miss J Alexander. Miss J and always fashion eats. Fashion icon and living legend, the gorgeous Twiggy. Hello guys. Big forehead Twiggy. <laughs> and a woman that I know and respect and have modeled for actually back in the day. Winkle, say how long. I know. <laughs> Miss Gabrielle Reese, pro athlete and model. I'm so happy you're here. Me too. You guys know about the fabulous prizes. The first is a contract with one of the top modeling agencies in the world, Elite Model Management. A spread and a cover of Seventeen magazine. A $100,000 contract there. with a Cover mess. Girl Cosmetics. All right, so now it's time for your individual evaluations. And after that, the judges will deliberate and determine which one of you will be eliminated. Eugenia, oh, you first today. Did right, she? Eugenia, so and I was going to already forgot. Modeling and action. So for your judging test today, we're going to test that. The boys here are going to choose a verb and an adverb, and then you have to act that out. So what you have to shake flirtatiously. Who couldn't get a better combination, <laughs> honey? Shake flirtatiously. Ski <laughs> sadly. Skip sensually. Win. <laughs> it looks stifled to me. Uh, mm. Dance. Aggressively. Oh, Dance aggressively. Please, you put me in a predicament. Box. <laughs> Joyfully. The next time I'm mad at somebody, I'm gonna I'm gonna kick your butt. I'm dizzily. <laughs> Carrie D. A. Carrie D. A. <laughs> okay, thank you. Carrie D. A. <laughs> I think Ansel's oh, going on. She ran out aggressively. <laughs> Ladies, I that was a Eugenia. test and a half, wasn't it? So, Eugenia, come on up. I felt it was, it wasn't really a shake for me. I mean, you could have shimmed a bit. It was a bit half-hearted for me. And every now and then you reminded me of Naomi Campbell, because I've been on photo shoots with her, and she has to, like, dance, and there's a certain... I wonder if Naomi and Tyra are friends. Like, a weak version of her. Are they? Like, push stronger. But it was definitely photogenic. I could see photographs. Yes. So from my perspective, I'm like, bam, bam. So you had a photo shoot where no. you were up in the heavens. Here's your best shot. To me, it looks like a, an astronaut, not a model. Yeah. You don't see any of your lovely, Can't see gorgeous. your gorgeous face. For me. They edit her with space in the background, a big helmet on and goggles, and Tyra goes, mm, it's giving astronaut, not model. Bitch, I wonder why. It's, it's definitely the face. Always, you know, make contact with that photographer, and, and it's expressing everything th through the face while being aware of your body. I don't see your model beauty. I'm not seeing the magic. Just on another planet. <laughs> okay, up next is Amanda. All right, Amanda, so for your verb and adverb, you have to ski sadly. I thought you were skiing, but it didn't look sad to me. It looked scary. I like that you committed, though. You were trying, whereas some of the girls behind you did not try. Okay, Amanda, let's see your best shot. Like a, not a W. <laughs> it's like a bit like a dead spider in this picture. Your face is pretty. Um, you've definitely got great angles, but you've got to be careful because your body is so shot. slim and slender that you've really got to really work with it to give us more angles. All right, thank you. Up next, Jada. Okay, Jada A. Jada All right, Jada, so you had to skip sensually. Jada, you're usually that girl that gives up in this room, and you didn't give up today. But when you got to the sensually, you just 
just didn't want to make yourself look different. I feel similar in being bigger, that every chance that you can use your body, because that's really the thing that can help you so much. If someone says, hey, do this. I feel just, similar just in being bigger. To say that she sees you as someone similar to her is a really big compliment. That's a huge compliment. All right, Jada, so you had a photo shoot in a wind tunnel, and here's your best shot. Looks like They're Michael all Jackson. giving the same pose. Doesn't it? Like old Michael, kind of? Girl, stop starting movies, huh? <laughs> See what you have to be careful of is your chin. You look like you have no control over your face. The closest, one of my least favorite closest. All right, up next is Ancho. You know, the trouble is you want to be a model. When you're a model, you're given things to do, and every time you're given something to do, you always seem terribly embarrassed about it. You don't feel happy about it. You ran out you like ran out. a dog chasing you. You ran out aggressively. You needed she you is to too dance shy. Aggressively. And it was the weirdest exit I've seen. She on is top way model. too shy. Besides Jade, when she left. And it's weird and disappointing because we're here because we believe in all of you, and then you just throw something away and run out. It's like, what's the point? And I think that that's really maybe one of the most important lessons is you saying, I'm here, I'm going to be committed. It's deciding to be a professional. And it's a life lesson. I like, honestly think she's too sensitive. Like, the other girls picking on her are literally It's probably, not just, literally literally it's probably just in general with you in life. You know, you carry who you are into this competition. Like, yeah. I feel yeah. like the other shoot. girls picking on her really made her anxious. Okay, okay. she looks good, though. That's that's actually the best angle on the face we've seen. Jay said that he had some strong okay, shots, she might be, but in person she might he does safe. not feel that you are graceful. I think you can still do more. You really had gone for it here, and I don't believe you she did. She might be safe. Even better than this. You look like Michael Jackson, too. <laughs> well, yeah, Maybe he's just does. living in a wind tunnel. All right, up next is Melrose. All right, Melrose, so you had to box uh, <laughs> joyfully. Hey, man. And what do you think we meant when we said box? Once I thought you meant, like, a box, like being yeah. a box. But I didn't know that it was boxing until I walked in. I'm like, oh my god. <laughs> but you know what? It was funny. Yeah. Is that this is called voguing, yeah. and so to make boxing fashionable, yeah. I thought you were genius. Yeah. You just blew yourself yeah. right there. And the fact that you made a commitment as Poor wrong girl. as it was it turned into something right. See, out to the back. That's what we're yeah. talking about. Yeah, it into something right. Okay, you had a photo shoot in a wind tunnel, and here is your best shot. Oh, that's beautiful. Oh, that's she that's the best body we had. She is. This is actually the first Stella picture we've seen. So I was a little nervous at first with all of the girls, because so far I have not she liked is. all the pictures that have come up. So I was thinking that this photo shoot might have been too hard and impossible. And I'm like beating myself up in the head going, why did I have them do this? But then I see this and I go, I had you guys do it because a great shot is possible. All right, Carrie D. She is. So Carrie D, <laughs> you had to do a verb and an adverb and you had to hide dizzily. Yeah. She did the best. You were what we've been saying. You I like Carrie D. It was absolutely fantastic. Yeah. There was a pose really? down there when you flipped upside down and your head was caught. What about when she was sitting in the middle of the runway and she was in the middle of all of us and you just hid behind your fingers. <laughs> and I was just like, great. perfect. That is so genius. It was brilliant. Yep. All right, so you had a photo shoot in a wind tunnel and here's your best shot. Oh, that's yeah. cool. oh she it's is. Cool. Really nice. Brilliant. You know why that's amazing? It's because you look like you are propelling forward, yes. like you're a superhero and going forward as opposed to she I mean, it's, it's uncomfortable. It really looks like you're going like. I love how half of their the critique is they're literally the critiquing them on the Simon Says. Jay, the photographer or the like, why is the first half of the critique like, you didn't like, be really good at Simon Says? Okay, I'm disappointed in you. And with something like this, you could have really hurt yourself. So it's important to focus and listen. Yeah. And last but not least is Michelle. Did Michelle fly? All right, Michelle, so you were supposed to swim frighteningly. Frighteningly? How do you say that? To swim frighteningly. Yeah, that. And it was pretty <laughs> frightful, I'm afraid. Yeah, hey, you, you chickened out to me. You kind of didn't really get it. Whenever I see girls like you and Ancho, it makes me go back to casting. And it makes me think about the girl that I did not choose, mm -hmm. but put you in her place. Because it's like those girls want to be here so badly and would commit so hard. So when I see you not committing, it makes me feel like a wasted space oh, on this. And that's not a good feeling for me to have. Either yeah, lesbian or Ancho. But you were the gonna challenge winner. Well done. They had to do kind of well, a role play where shit. Dan Barrett is this, you know, big NASCAR guy saying, baby, don't model. They hate Ancho, And she's yeah. saying, no, I'm going to pursue my career. I'm not going to let you hold me down. Quite right. I have issues. I came up with that idea yeah. for, for personal yeah. reasons. Yeah, yeah. 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 So you had a photo shoot in a wind tunnel. And here's your best shot. She ain't. Again. Despite the fact you're actually as slim as you are, in this shot, they're not worried by it. The face is caught the light, and it's different. Jay said that your she hands look like a catcher's mitt, that they weren't graceful. Keep them soft. Okay, she looks good, though. So now it's time for the judges to deliberate. And when we call you back, yeah. one of you will be I think bottom two is Ancho and Jada.
I think Anshul's over. Seven young ladies stand before me, but I only have six Michelle's photos picture was good, in though. my hands. And these Jada's photos wasn't. represent the six of you that will still be in the running towards becoming America's next top model. The first name that I'm going to call. Thank you, Jay Bella. Oh. Welcome. <laughs> yes, finally, Carrie D gets called first. Carrie D's underrated. Carrie D's underrated. The next name that I'm going to call. <laughs> the box. <laughs> Melrose. <laughs> Jada. Okay, period. Jada's safe. I also like Jada. Jada, this picture is crappy, but I called your name third because you committed today. He said, I'm going to look like an idiot and foolish, and it's going to be okay. The next name that I'm going to call. Oh, my God. Angel is so over. Amanda. The next name that I'm going to call. Eugenia did not do bad. Eugenia. Oh, Ooh. my God. Angel is over. No. She's my favorite. But beautiful challenge today. You went for it. You show me. What was it? <laughs> shake it, baby. Shake it. I'll shake the hair. Flip it like a white girl. There you go. Work it out. <laughs> Congratulations. You're still in the running. Tyra is still a little too much model. for me. <laughs> I only have one photo in my hands. And this photo represents the girl that is still in the running towards becoming America's next top model. I will call only one the girl that the I do not call is the The twin is safe. The twin is safe. You go home. Anshul, you started this competition. This face Thank that you, was so Welcome absolutely back. beautiful. It was almost scary. It was so beautiful. But if you don't believe that, if you don't commit yourself and say, I might not be feeling so beautiful right now, but I'm going to fake it until I make it. If we don't see that, it makes us say, why is she here? Why should she continue in this competition? Maybe she wants it, but when you really want something, you show up and you show up hard. And you this show whole up. monologue, she's and gonna say like three words to Michelle. A girl with all this talent, natural talent. Some girls just have it. Even if they don't necessarily want a model, they just have it. And I look at you, and the judges look at you, and we all say, <laughs> "You have to want it." She's saying. And today, and with the judging test, this isn't the first time we saw she you just throw something away. <laughs> Oh my god, please save Anshul. So Michelle, you have to start showing us that you want this. You can't goof and laugh your way through things. You can do that if you're doing a good job, but if you're messing up, it just makes us say, whatever. There's two of them, just, let's just get the other one. She wants it. You don't want that. <laughs> Show us that you care, because I think you do. Congratulations. You're still on the running towards becoming America's Next Top Model. Carrie D is a real one. <laughs> Carrie D is a real one. <laughs> but I don't. Yeah. Yeah. Bye. Thank you, everyone. Bye. Okay, I'm rooting for. Okay. Who are we rooting for now? I'm she was my favorite. My oh my god, she got bullied and it literally ruined her confidence. Like, that is so messed up. Literally, she got bullied for being fat. And she probably has an eating disorder. Oh, okay. Another. We're watching another. Like, I need to know what happens next. Nine. To, okay, probably watch. This might be the last one. So we can save three for the last day. Watch the whole end. Oh, you guys want to see her? I'm not giving it my all on the challenge out there. But you know what? In a way, I was expecting it. I'm just a little self conscious. And her picture's age. Damn. Okay, better. not that one. Her picture's age. I honestly believe that God has something else planned for me. So I'm not letting it get me down. Of course, it hurts right now. Because, hey, look, I made it so far. It's me not stepping out of my box. It's a life lesson learned. Is she Instagram famous now? Is she Instagram famous? She wait, dated Jim Carrey? What? She hasn't, she hasn't lived without her parents She's yet. still My sister ended up in the bottom too, and I was really nervous because I actually thought my sister was going to go home. 
And I can't wait for one of the twins to go home, that honestly. You want my sister knows that I'm confused. I've told her that. I'm like, I have no idea. So I didn't really want a model, but I wanted to do it with my sister. <laughs> you think that I act a fool? Wait till you meet my girl. Uh -oh. Love, Tyra. We're in trouble. You need to make the heart before you write on it. I miss my boyfriend. That's like the hardest part of this competition. I'm sick of living in this house. What is the quality of this episode? It's been so long since we're ravenous in each other's embrace. I don't really hear what the other the girls think of me, but I definitely sucks. know. I know that they think I'm bitchy and, you know, I speak my mind a little too much. I want it, but I don't know how to make it my dream. You don't have to. Don't force a dream. It doesn't have to be just because you're a model. It doesn't have to be your greatest dream. The twins, Michelle's like, I don't really like this, whatever. For them, it's all just like an experience to do. For me, it's a dream, and I really want this. And I'd hate for me to go home and have someone that doesn't want this stay. It's like making clicking noises. <laughs> it's like, what the fuck? Should we skip? Right when we got to LA about the Trump theater, we had no idea what we were doing, but we didn't know exactly what was going to go on. Are we ready to rock and roll? Hey, all right, I'm Tasha just Smith, deal with lady. It. I'm an actress. And I also teach acting, and I'm a very good friend of Miss Kai. Okay, we'll you think she's crazy? Why? Trust me, this is where she got the crazy from. As a model, you know your photographers are gonna constantly yell out is. emotions to you, and you're gonna have to be able to do it on cue. Carrie, why don't you get up here? Cause you seem like a loud mouth. Tasha, oh. she's loud and energetic. So we're just looking forward to having an interesting day. Right. The first exercise, ladies, we're gonna start off with. Never heard it's of called her. the silly dilly exercise. Tyler Perry. This exercise is about I've breaking like down all Tyler physical Perry barriers and boundaries. Life. I have spontaneity, bitches. Let's do it right now. More. Walk crazier. That's More. Kelly Rowland. Really? You can get sillier than that, girl. Come on. I thought she had short hair. Now that's a girl. That ain't afraid to be ugly. You're done. <laughs> You Amanda off the stage. Come on. Ugly faces. Faces not ugly enough. Face not ugly enough. Get off the stage. Distort your body. Come on, more. Amanda's a lot better at acting, so I think she's gonna do a little better Have than the other girls. Have any of the girls You're ever done a tell-all about enough. being on the show? Working. You just kinda had to let go of everything. I feel bad for all, all these of different them. emotions. Next exercise is Child called did, really? dump, dumping out everything you're feeling. I want you to let it out right now. If you want to cry, cry. But whatever it is you're feeling, feel it. The clicking is really, really out of place. No matter me. what I do here, it never adds up, and it seems like it's so much easier for everybody else. More! Scream it to you the top of your lungs. Can't Kim because people already know what happened. It's really I like nice. you guys. Just, it's not sped up. I'm up. just tired, Dying so like I'm like talking really slow. So everything. it just seems sped up. I want to take a bus. I want to try harder. Whatever you're feeling as over the top as possible. Oh, Tyra says that, oh, you don't want this, you don't want this. I don't know what I want. Should I skip to like the end challenge? Especially when someone's going to people. <laughs> my strong point, but I figured, you know, just go for it. That's what Penn always says, you know, I don't go for it. So just went for it. Tyra, you don't know me! Two. No idea what I want. Like, this doesn't really matter. People are mad at me because they expect me to be all <laughs> She's flowery being serious. And, you know, all energy. I don't know, I'm just really stressed. Oh my god! <laughs> I'm sick of people thinking that models can't feel. I'm sick of people thinking this career is just something that is that is just like so great. It's hard. I see people break down in front of panel and have their dreams smashed. I want this so bad. I've been through so much. I have tried killing myself. Carrie D revealed something that was very personal. That was just like a shocker, you know, to all of us. Because I know what it feels like to want to die and not live anymore. And for the first time in my life, I feel like I'm doing something right. And I feel like I'm alive. Carrie, I'm really proud of you. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Shut up, Kelly. I think it was really hard for Carrie up there, and I think that we were stirring up so much emotion, and this whole experience has been so intense for all of us that when you get up there and those emotions start rolling out of your mouth, they just kind of take a hold of you. Oh, my God. That 
Jake, you're so sweet. No, 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 don't let me, me cry. No, but you know how rare someone like you is? And, like, that's exactly what I needed. I didn't even know what I needed. Okay. I just started talking, and you know, before I knew it, I was saying things, and I was crying, and I don't really remember like thinking I was gonna say these things. You know, it's just a breaking point. Good hug. Good hug. Good hug. Good hug. Okay, let's go do it. Let's go finish the competition, right? Okay, ladies, let's Hearing go. Hearing kids at home is up there. Tyra's freaked out by suicidal people for sure. Expressing yourself, and that's what it was about, and you are She's gonna need it for your challenge. Everybody in here is about to shoot their own. You know what Tyra would tell her? Tyra would tell her, there's a thousand girls who wish they were on this show right now. It's really selfish of you to say that. Okay. Actually, I'm really excited about the silent movie. Tasha's going to be yelling out directions to us, and we're supposed to act them out. I want you to run to the window. Run to the window. Desperately, desperately. Oh, my God, a lemon. Yay. There's a knock at the door. Sad, sad. Drink that prune juice like it's the best tasting prune juice this in the world. This show is literally. Keep crying while you're talking. You're such a bad actor. Like can't even my mind. Oh god, even in life. a silent. Oh my god, a lemon, a lemon. Be hopeful. Like, Who could it be? Sad. The Kool Aid is good. The Kool Aid is so good. Rub your stomach. Look really hungry. Open it up. It's like a sandwich. It's like it's like a rib. It's a cheeseburger. Wow. It's somebody with a telegram. You're excited. Oh no, but it's bad news. I'm a broke down and out model that looks like a boy now because I don't have my hair. It was really hard because she made me eat a lemon and I was like the only one who ate the whole thing and swallowed it. But, you know, I just really need to do my best. What because the I think fuck? Kind of you can't hide your face. I said, bite the lemon. Cry uncontrollably. What is she going to say to Carrie D? <laughs> I'm trying to keep a straight face and go through these emotions while Tasha's literally yelling at us. Yeah. Keep talking to the person on the phone. Me and Prune Juice still mix very well, so um, I drank a big old gulp, and you're not staying in character. I am 135% sure that I'm not going to win the challenge. Is there a bag anywhere? Actually, I'm 200% sure I'm not going to win the challenge. I better see some throw up, because I, I, I just don't believe you. Ladies, thank you for a wonderful day, and you're going to know who the winner is very soon. Congratulations, and good luck to all of you guys. Tell me about your day. I want to hear about why it was so bad. Because I let out my biggest secret and I didn't mean to. Sweet. How'd that happen? Because today thank I just like so go through emotions asthma. and I was like, I'm there crying. Almost and then like, I go for the first time in my life, you. I feel like I'm doing something right. I feel like I'm actually here for a reason. Oh, sweetie. That must have been so hard. It was a nice release. There's nothing holding me back right now. And I feel so liberated and free. Like, I'm just going for it because nothing is going to stop me. My good friend Tasha chose the winner, so pop in this disc and see who made a scene. Believe me, the winner won't be the only one surprised. Oh, <laughs> Tyra. Daisy! <laughs> They had to give her the win. They had to. <laughs> From how I tell. He has horses through. Oh my god. This clicking noise is really making this silent film mean. <laughs> this competition and like I have a chance. I'm waiting for my alarm clock to go off. I'm winning this great prize. I'm feeling my dream is wanting to be an actress also. Oh my gosh, I'm going to Spain. Period. Today I'm doing my challenge win. I am a guest star on One Tree Hill. Today I'm playing a girl named Tia. I'm a model. 
bus was actually really comfortable. The male models were very good looking. somebody else. And just skip to the channel. They didn't really speak a lot of English. I think the first one we picked up was the one who spoke the most English. Have you ever tried any Spanish food at all? Um, beans and rice. <laughs> <laughs> The clock is giving one of them about to get murdered and it's like they're recovered by hell. Hi, Mel. Hi, Mel. Hi, Mel. Hi, Mel. Commercial and a native tongue. Oh, so here's your script. Memorize it. Pick a male model right now and get ready for an on-screen kiss debut with your new boo. Hugs and kisses. Oh, God. Oh, no. You're joking, right? Because we are all having the hardest time trying to understand these boys. And now we have to speak what they're saying. <laughs> we have to practice. So no, the lesbian kiss a boy. Well, what if we don't get to practice anymore? What's it? So purple? No. So do you want me to be like that? No, I, I, I don't like it. Yeah, we're almost done here. You what? You understand? No. Do you think? No. Okay. And I say, I don't like it. Good. Jada's partner, Nacho, tells Jada that he doesn't even like black girls. She's like, are you serious? No one should be treated like that. I would hate if I had that guy. And I'd make out with, like, Amanda before I'd make out with him. He doesn't want to help me. Do you like it, the rabbit? He doesn't want to help me. I'm worried about tomorrow's shoot because I have to make out with this guy who's an idiot and a jerk. And he says he doesn't like black girls. I was, like, so excited to go to Spain. And now, you know, my first night, it's just like, okay, that's kind of ruined. I feel so bad for Jada. Like, she gets literally bullied Beautiful. every episode by the judges. They ruined her look, ruined her confidence. But no, it's uh, really authentic, like, very nice Spanish apartment. She has not really had one Hi, good Mel. moment. Welcome and it's to not even her fault. Naya, where you'll soon rest your head. By the way, the challenge winner has the first choice of her bed. Hello, Tara, that's me, eh? Clearly, eh? she shows the big room with the big bed and all the closet space. I get spread out so far. Good for her, period. Yeah, they literally made her cut her hair just for them to make I fun of her for having short I stayed up two extra hours hair. last night studying because I wanted to know these lines. And I had them down. Tetrawacha and the Google copies. Tetrawang is a native language, and there's a little bit of Spanish mixed with a bunch of other dialects from around the world. I can't roll my tongue naturally. I sound like a dead car. Pretty. She has a big forehead. I don't kiss a lot of guys. In fact, I haven't kissed a guy since I was like 10. It was my neighbor behind a shed. Hopefully I don't suck, and hopefully it isn't too awkward. I don't think we're gonna have to kiss the guys. I don't know. Yes, we are. We're having a serious makeout sesh. I'm loyal to my boyfriend, like really loyal. Kissing this random guy who's so rude. That really sucks. Well, cheers. It'll be fine. <laughs> Tyra looks pretty, uh, finally. Oh my god, yes, Eva Longoria. She's eating. And I don't know if you all know of Custo Barcelona. Have you heard of that designer? And we all know about the famous Balenciaga bags and all the celebrities wear. And also, Esther Cañadas is a really famous model. She has blonde hair and she has lips bigger than mine, Carrie D's and Mel Rose's and Eugenia's put together. <laughs> well, they're from Spain. They're from here. Are y'all ready to get your day started? Yeah. yeah? And did everybody choose a man? You don't like yours? He said he didn't like black girls. <laughs> he said he didn't like black girls. So I was like, oh, this is good. Well, you're going to have to give him a kiss to make him love some black girls because what do they say? Once they go black, they don't go back. There you go. You could just give her a All new right, model, so Tyra. Get out here. Woo! Hi, oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Thanks, so just okay, put him with one of the white girls Adios. and get, like, like change his life. <laughs> See you, Tyra. Are you guys excited? Yeah. The commercial today is for secret deodorant. So it's all about displaying strength and confidence, especially when the pressure's on. And today, the pressure is on. We're going to celebrate the strength of the women here in Barcelona and speak in their language. I don't think Tyra does anything Alrighty? now. Maybe she's, like, on a talk show. I am feeling overwhelmed. This is the hardest thing I've ever done in my life, trying to memorize this language that you've never heard of before. 
Well, I was pretty sure everybody's gonna make a big deal out of my kiss scene, which I, I had no problem with. I was like, whatever, I gotta kiss it. I'll just do it. I was more worried about the language than the kiss. Now, I want to introduce you guys to your commercial director. Dennis, come up here. Hola. You're walking through all these sexy men, kind of telling your little secrets. Okay, if Jada goes home from this, I'm make me believe be this, so Michelle. Action. Like, if Jada goes home from this, I'm gonna be so nervous. You got these cue cards to read off of, but like you go in there thinking you know what you're gonna say. You partly memorize the lines and you're like, okay, if I see how, how it's written, I'll be able to say it. But no, it's completely different. Feels. Secret. Report for una dona. The part that I thought was gonna be horrendous, which was the kiss, was the best part about the whole thing. You were kind of giving the camera a cold shoulder. So it doesn't matter if I get words wrong? You can break the dialogue if it's too long. Eating con tatuasha, cutting guan in defeat. My strategy was act like I knew what I was talking about, and that was it. She and then we got to the kiss part, and it was like the worst kiss I've ever had in my life. It was like trying to kiss my closed fist or something like that. Based off some of your photo shoots, this would have been flat, but you were really personable. She ate. And that's a good she thing. She ate. Oh, I like La unica. Veo. La. La. I'm not really good at reading cue cards, even if they're in English. So once I forgot something and I had to read the cue card, it just went awful. Secret. Pro for un, par, par una dona. Amanda and Michelle were boring, but in different ways. Like not passionate like and what? not sexy. Is your internet yeah. okay? It sounds yeah. fine to me. The guy is a jerk, and I don't want to talk to him, I don't want to look at him, and I certainly don't ever want to kiss him. I feel so sick right now. Is pro for para guardar un secret? I cannot do this, oh my god. Actions speak louder than words, so if you look defeated, it reads as defeat. Okay. Intik un traja. Jada, can I tell you something? First of all, you can't cry because we don't have time to fix your makeup. I'm sorry. What's the problem? <laughs> I can't do this. I'm crying because I'm frustrated. I'm frustrated that I have to kiss this guy. I'm frustrated that I suck really bad at this. I just hope I don't ever have to go through that again. This is so abusive. <laughs> I'm thinking it's more important for me to be in character and really get the character down than to get these lines. Which, why are you wearing that? Wardrobe set her up. For the day, that was probably one of the best reads. What? Trust me. <sighs> okay. Good luck. Thank you. Do you remember? Yep. Steps? Yep. Uh, yeah. yeah, pretty much, yeah. If I screw up, you can yell at me. Why do they put all the girls in Action. cute clothes and it's put pro, Melrose pro in that part. nasty outfit? It's pro par gadra un secret. Magra dava, la seros futas de Betty. Carrie D's Catalan sounded like Swedish slash Cantonese. It was so painful Queen. to watch. Tano una valasios seriosa. I couldn't even tell you right now the first line. So pro for par. I don't she know what to say. I speak English. She was 40 inside. Uh, Hi, ma'am. Tomorrow you will meet with the judges. Only five will continue on in hopes of becoming America's next top model. I have no idea what the judges are going to say about my commercial. And this is the first time I really, like, bombed. They're going to be rough. I know it. I think Jada might be the Hola, chicas bonitas. Hola. Yes. Bienvenidos a la cámara. Do you know what that means? Welcome to the judging room. How much longer? The is top the six that made it across the water. That's a really, really big feat. You all know our prizes, right? A contract with one of the top modeling agencies in the world, Elite Model Management. A cover and six page spread in 17 the magazines. And a $100,000 contract with CoverGirl Cosmetics. And of course, you know our judges. But today they're in España. El primero judge is Nigel Barker. Hey, ladies, good to see you. Give us some Spanish, Nigel. Hola. Hola. <laughs> <laughs> so the next and is the sexy, come. lovely, and tousled haired. Runway diva coach extraordinaire, Miss J. Alexander. Miss J is Hello mother. Back. I love Miss J. And legendary fashion icon, Twiggy. Hola. Great to be in Barcelona. <laughs> and your Hola. commercial director, Miss Dennis Rovira. Hi, como estais? All right, so now it is time for your individual evaluations. And after that, the judges will deliberate. And we will determine which one of you will be eliminated. Michelle. 
Michelle, so this week you learned a lot about physicality and everything, and that all culminated into a commercial which you had to speak in Catalan. You had to sell secret deodorants, and there was a nice little surprise at the end of the commercial that I'll save for the judges. So let's take a look at the finished product. Michelle, let's see your best take. So, for a fort for Guadar secrets, un secret. I think un tatua caron ingu avi. Con serion nostras. The commercial kind of came together, honestly. Secret for a for una dona. Well, the kiss was good until you came up. Have you ever kissed a boy before? I was like 10. <laughs> that doesn't count. I was really enjoying watching you, but I was not enjoying listening to you. The bottom line is that you didn't relate to the, any of the boys you were talking to. Even if you are reading, you've got to just take it in for a second, then look to the model and have a chat. I mean, this is you Michelle. Do She's a lesbian. You have to think about the words in English. Because if you're just saying, secret for per una donna, what the heck is that? But if you're saying secret strong enough for a woman, you're going to go, per una donna. Well, thank you, Michelle. Eugenia. All right, Eugenia, so let's see your best take. Es por pa' guardar en secret. She ate and she looks fucking good. Like, she's giving mom. La única la raro, pero la que mayor chica te es por acá. La brown corn sería en las nosotros en fileras. Like, she ate. Secret. Profit una dona. All right, Eugenia, I gotta say that so far you're the best. Did you kind of like ad lib some words up in here? Yeah, I did. I ad libbed a lot of them. You did a very good job because I kind of tried to follow my thought. That don't sound right, but it sounds right. I'm impressed with you. All right, Eugenia. She Thank ate. you. Here it is. She ate. Let's see how you did. Oh, no, I'm scared. It's pro part. Pro, it's pro part. Barra un secret. Arregades vech biora. Magrela musica funke. Why is she walking like that? They're better off home, better less students. Oh, sorry. The weirdest Catalan I ever heard, but she looked very beautiful. The Catalan? That was the least of your problems. Sweetheart, you'd almost look drunk in that. It looked a little crazy to me. It was like a train wreck. You were speaking Spapanese. <laughs> it was such a so mixture and you were lost in translation. You know, it's very disappointing, Carrie D, because the girl that won the challenge and the girl that's been doing so well in this competition is not here. It looks very amateur. It doesn't look like you came overseas and you're one of the top six. You were the challenge winner. She does look like Sandra Lee, you're right. To me, that kind of canceled it out. It, it was unforgivable. Well, yes, but also memorable because it was that bad. Yeah. All right, Katie. She's over. Jada. Jada, you oh, look no, nervous. Oh, no, Jada might have done right. worse. Blue this. Thanks for the warning. Let's see. Your best take. Is <laughs> Thanks for the warning. I think you were right to warn us. It was like watching a car crash. Oh, that was a big old open saw. <laughs> That was appalling. I mean, it's... You obviously cannot act. You just fell flat on your face, really. I cried. I was so mad. I sat there and cried on, on set. I just, I was so angry. Who were you angry with? Myself. I couldn't do it. I was so angry. I could not get it together. Well, it... Jane, if it wasn't the language, it has to be something deeper than language. I was nervous, and I was thinking about Ben. OK, this guy doesn't like me. When I spoke to you guys, you told me that this is the guy that said that he didn't want to kiss a black girl? He doesn't like black girls. Oh. oh yeah. That guy said that? He told me that to me the night before, and I feel like he's crawling in his skin just to kiss me. Bottom line is you're going to take control. Exactly. It's not about him. He's just an extra. That should not have stopped her from doing the job what? that she was sent there to do. I, I can sympathize with you for, you know, a guy saying that he doesn't like you, but it pretty much was dreadful. But the little touch was every now and then the light caught your face and you looked absolutely radiant. Up next she is better not go home for this. That's all I know. Let's see what Los patins la próxima para la acción. Upo a tren. Seren 
Hey, little sissies. And they're gonna love it, too. It's not a perfect Catalan, but I, I felt like I could direct you. <laughs> this I is don't literally speak her. Spanish, I don't speak Catalan. I understood everything you were saying. I love the way you, with everyone, even the people walking through, you linked with, laughed. And they're laugh, like, yes! Yeah, yeah. You know, two hours before I went to bed, even though we only got like four hours of sleep. To try and memorize it. One of my favorite parts of it was in the end when you were kind of in his face, and then up, and then like down, and then up, and then down, and then up. That's what girls do when they're like in love. All right, thank you. All right, Amanda. It's so bright. So let's see your best take. Avogada. She's really a flop. She looks like a gas station worker. La musica de moda. She acts like she has schizophrenia. Como se bien? El sur, el nuestras fields. I will say. Melrose is like the least shy, so I think that's playing to her favor. Una dona. Because so when the girls act reserved, they don't like it. That's what that's what it looked like. It came off like that, which is the problem. You've got to go for it. You've got to commit. The beginning of the commercial, I thought you looked beautiful. I want one of the to get eliminated. The camera so likes you. I agree. The camera I like loves Michelle you. Michelle Moore. Then you started tripping with the words and you lost it. All right. Thanks, Amanda. All like right, so now it's time for the judges Jesus. to deliberate, oh, yeah. and after that, I will call you back and announce which one of you is gonna have to go okay, back skip. to the US. This quality of... is really taking me out. I, can't I wanted to this. close my eyes. She has. Light isn't on. This is the serious performance. Like, I can't. And these photos represent the five young ladies that will still be in the running towards becoming America's next top. The first name that I'm going to call Melrose. She did the best. You kicked butt. You really, really did. And that little extra something that you gave paid off. Congratulations. You're still in the running towards becoming America's Next Top Model. Thank you so much. You're welcome. The next name that I'm going to call? Eugenia. Eugenia. She Eugenia, is, yeah. these judges are saying that Barcelona has done you well. We saw a light in you that we've never seen. Eugenia's somebody to look out for now. The next name that I'm going to call? Amanda. I feel like either Carrie D. So we saw your commercial and we were like, she's not Jada so dreadful. But you don't want to be not so dreadful. You want to be amazing. Congratulations. The next name that I'm going to call? Michelle. You look absolutely beautiful. I, know, I like both of them. You and you okay, have so much I want Jada so to fire. say more. Congratulations. I want Jada to say more. Oh, I mean, Gracias. <laughs> well, Jada and Carrie D, please step forward. I only have one photo in my hands. And this photo represents the girl that will still be in the running towards becoming America's next top model. I will call only one name. The girl that I do not call must immediately this return to her apartment in Barcelona. Nevada, but this is not After fair. Carrie D, you're the girl that is so full of life that from week to week takes amazing pictures. The judges love Carrie D up until today because a big part of this win is to have a CoverGirl contract. And it's not just posing in a picture for a CoverGirl product. It's about being in a commercial. And what we saw today is a girl that can't deliver that. And Jada, you're a girl that has had probably nine lives in this competition. You've stood before me more than once. Some judges doubt your passion for this. But then there's other judges behind me that say, but her bone structure and her face is so strong. <laughs> and some girls need a little bit more grooming, a little bit more time. So who goes home? What? The girl that the judges don't think can deliver a commercial. <laughs> or the girl that needs a little bit more time. I think you can deliver a commercial, Carrie D. I've never been so happy to see myself. <laughs> I think you can do it. I think sometimes when we get so much praise, we're like, I'm fine, funny, I'm great. Now it's like, Carrie D's not perfect. Yeah, I know that. Congratulations. You're still in the running towards becoming America's Next Top Model. Thank you, Gina. Any hugs, Thank you. I am disappointed in how everything went down. It was horrible. It really wasn't a great way to, like, leave. But I try to make it positive, like, obviously Eugenia's something out in me, next and episode, it kind of made me want to try harder in the competition. Eugenia's Being out Being insecure next with my episode, hair and all trust, that, it, it definitely took me a longer time that. than the other girls to, like, develop all those, like, characteristics Her that you need to be in this competition. But, 
it's gonna work out. You know, things are gonna work out. Okay, should we watch one more or should we do three tomorrow? What do you guys want to do? One more and then two tomorrow or three tomorrow? Oh my god, it's so... I can't tell. I can't tell. Three tomorrow, it's midnight. You're right, it is late. It's late. It's late, we'll watch three tomorrow. It's late, we'll watch three tomorrow. Tomorrow's the Monday. You guys have eighth grade tomorrow, seriously. Okay, before we end, hold on. Well, let me do my uh, my closing. Let me get my opera opened up here. Let me get my opera opened up here, you guys. This is really important. <laughs> I want to remind you guys: this stream is sponsored by Opera. Go ahead and go into the. Uh, go ahead and go into the. Uh, description and download it. It's your download best browser I've ever used. Uh, all the features you could ever want amazing it's so good you guys will gag you guys will live for this drama be sure to clock into opera downloading it supports the stream and supports me so thank you guys so much i really appreciate it thank you guys for hanging out um this vod will be up till tomorrow's stream so if you miss any of the america's next tap model be sure to check it out Okay, you guys. Bye.